Welcome, and thanks for joining Basingstoke Salvation Army's daily devotional, Battle Drill. For more information, go to basingstokesalvationarmy.sermon.net forward slash battle underscore drill underscore daily underscore devotionals. Hello again. Would you like to turn with me to our passage for this week? It's 2 Thessalonians chapter 3, verses 6 to 13. Today I'm going to read it from the message translation. Our orders, backed up by the Master Jesus, are to refuse to have anything to do with those among you who are lazy and refuse to work the way we taught you. Don't permit them to freeload on the rest. We showed you how to pull your weight when we were with you, so get on with it. We didn't sit around on our hands expecting others to take care of us. In fact, we worked our fingers to the bone, up half the night moonlighting, so you wouldn't be burdened with taking care of us. And it wasn't because we didn't have a right to your support. We did. We simply wanted to provide an example of diligence, hoping it would prove contagious. Don't you remember the rule we had when we lived with you? If you don't work, you don't eat. And now we're getting reports that a bunch of lazy good-for-nothings are taking advantage of you. This must not be tolerated. We command them to get to work immediately. No excuses, no arguments, and earn their own keep. Friends, don't slack off in doing your duty. If anyone refuses to obey our clear command written in this letter, don't let them get by with it. Point out such a person and refuse to subsidise his freeloading. Maybe then he'll think twice. But don't treat him as an enemy. Sit him down and talk about the problem as someone who cares. Amen. You have a calling on your life. Sometimes we think God's calling is only for Salvation Army officers or church ministers and pastors. Salvation Army officers used to describe ministry as the work. But the truth is that God calls all of us to work. Paul and Silas were God's missionaries, working to honour God and to help others. Paul encourages the Thessalonian Christians and us to imitate them and do the same. It doesn't matter if you're a Salvation Army officer, a teacher, a cleaner, an office worker or a stay-at-home parent. Paul encourages you to see your work as working for God. Do it to honour him and to help others. Whatever you do, do it in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Teaching children, writing a proposal, selling something or taking out the rubbish can all be a blessing if they are done to honour God and to help other people. Your work, whatever it is, is significant. So let's all work for God and help others today, whatever we're doing. As you prepare to do that, why not think about these questions? Have you ever thought of your work as being done for God? Can you think of something you do that could be done with this in mind? And I hope to see you again soon for another battle drill. We hope you've been encouraged and equipped by this daily devotional. Why not find us on Facebook, Instagram or YouTube by searching for Basingstoke Salvation Army. And join us again soon for another battle drill. God bless you.